Hey, feel I'm in the mood for a switch up. I hit the function, hit the rose right till I hiccup. I hit the stage and leave with money that's a stick up. She picture perfect, so I told him I'm a. We are back, ladies and gents, back in. Do these game day vlogs. Wasn't sure if I was going to play this week, but uh, we've got to buy next weekend, so decided that I would be making the trip up to Darwin <clears throat> for the weekend. So, very, very exciting times. Hopefully, we can get the dub this week. We've got the Crocodiles, who are one of the best teams in the comp, I believe. But also, very, very exciting that we'll get to be linking up with uh, Mitch Robertson as well, who's going to be playing for the Buffaloes. So, bit of a Rob Vlogs time, prime, prime train link up this weekend, which should be very, very exciting, and hopefully. Um, we can take away the chuckies. I'm running with an interesting kit tonight. I've got a very oversized jumper, the Nurture hat, and of course the Prime Train shorts as well. Prime Train shorts are still on the website, so make sure you go and check them out uh, before they run out. Just going for a coffee before the fly, mate. Hot chocolate, Just going for a coffee. And a boost juice. What's in the boost juice, mate? Mango. Mango, just mango. Mango. Nothing else. <laughs> Hello, everything's sorted. Free seat. Let's go. Just landed. It's like I think it's 1 a.m. here, but it's 2. It's like 2 a.m. Melbourne time. I slept pretty good on the plane, but I'm pretty tired. Jumping with the boys. One of the boys is picking us up, and then we're gonna go. Uh, yeah, the hotel should be good. This is the room that we've got. Two massive queen beds, which is amazing. I'm sure we've got some sort of viewer here, which is fantastic. A great TV, a good mirror. This is the fit. Looking, uh, we're looking okay, we're looking okay. We've got some good hanging space, and of course, a sweet little shower as well. This is beautiful, man. Good little spot. Pretty happy with it overall, I'd say. All right, so it is 1.24 in the morning. We're gonna be uh, pretty much switching off now, put everything down on charge, unpack a few things, and then we'll be off to sleep in the new crib here at the Novotel. Gonna be very, very exciting, guys. Hopefully you're enjoying the vlog so far. Uh, I think that um, I think that it's all gone pretty well so far. We'll wake up tomorrow morning and go and hit um, a little bit of a walk or something and then obviously go out for breakfast with the boys. Try and replicate what we did last week because we played well last week, so we're going to try and replicate that again this week. That's the best way to go about it. But then not overthink it too much as well and be like, oh, let's try and do everything right or everything inch perfect is what we did last week because at the end of the day, it might not affect your game um, that much. You just have to get into a good headspace of being like, I'll be sweet, I'll be fine if I just prepare well and do the things that matter. Don't get too super superstitious. Love you, good night, all. See you tomorrow morning. Good morning, everybody, it's game day. What a great feeling it is to be alive on a day like today. What we have, uh, we've had about a six hour sleep, which was good. Obviously, uh, the boys are gonna come pick me up and we're gonna go for a little bit of a breakfast like we always do before the game. Catch up with a few boys and uh, link it all up. Slept pretty well, feel okay, You're gonna have a shower. I'll feel a hundred million bucks after that shower. I'm a little bit tired, but that's all right. Shower, shave, cut my hair, and we'll be good to go. It's game day, very, very exciting. It's about 9.30 now, our game's up till 4.30, so you've got plenty of downtime before the game. So just chill out, relax, do everything by the book. It's a very, very big game today against a very, very good side, so we'll see how we go. Let's get it, let's shower. I'll see you guys very, very soon. How clean are these balls? 
He's still rapping with it. He's still got Prime on the inside. We out here. Look at them, they're so beautiful. Let's go. This is the fit for the day. Looking good in the sun. Uh, we've got Nash on the back. We're rolling out. We are out to get some breakfast. Huss is downstairs waiting, so I've got to go. Let's get it. What's for breakfast today, Hussey? Michael Hussey. Scrambled eggs. Scrambled eggs? Yeah. With coffee? Uh, I've already, already had one. Oh, I was up too late. What are you getting for breakfast today, Pendles? No. A good attitude, maybe? <laughs> oh. How do you record on this? Hey guys, welcome back to Prime Train's vlog. We're here. We're here with Tommy Tusks. Yes. Yeah. Tommy Tusks, what did you get today, bro? Thanks, <laughs> Benedictus. Hey, Pendles, how are you? Oh. Time train out. <laughs> Breakfast of champions here. A bit of NBA going on with the almond latte with caramel. You get a bit of caramel in there. Bit of caramel. <laughs> Here's my breakfast. Not gonna lie. Ham cheese croissant. Eggs. Benedict. How long do we have to wait for this? 40 minutes. Ask you as you got any food. Coffee, do you want a casarino? Don't come here. <laughs> <laughs> you guys were happy with it? Yeah. You guys were happy with it? 15 minutes, perfect. Yeah. yeah. Eggs running. Eggs running. Let's see if my eggs are any good. I hope, I hope it's right. <laughs> yeah, good egg. Oh. Happy with that. We got that sub as well. What'd you get? Chicken ham and cheese. Chicken teriyaki. Ham and cheese. And we got that chicken classic sub. We're about like two hours before the game, I reckon. How long's the game? Five? Five hours? Four thirty. What are you sending out back today? Yep. Big deadly. Big deadly. <laughs> Come on, We love AFLW, I'm a number one AFLW supporter. I put money into the competition, it's actually sponsored by Prime. That's how much I love. Big This is an ad for our own drinks. I'm feeling pretty flat today. You're feeling flat? Yeah. Are you feeling flat? Gee, are you feeling flat? Um, gee, we, are you feeling flat? Well, you know what you should do? Have it alive. How much better are you feeling already? Wow, I feel alive. Amazing. Monkey. I feel alive. <laughs> <laughs> here we are, ladies and gents. Kazali's Palmerston Club. I played some footy here. Last time we played here, do you remember? It was the first game we played together, and guess what happened? Guess what happened? Gotta, we got a win, didn't we, baby? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Again, remember against Maggie's? Oh, that was against the Magpies. And it was like, remember the game got stopped for 30 minutes? Yes, that's right. Because of the, because of the thunderstorm and lightning. It's a bit scary. Oh, oh, no, I don't get scared by anything. I don't get scared. I'm so tough. Here we go. 10 Bro, calories. I feel alive. You feel good? I feel alive, eh? <laughs> hey. Fucking hell. Oh, damn. Let's see. Fire out. 10 calories. All good for you. 11 out of 10. 11 out of 10. <laughs> Put me in the forward line. <laughs> <laughs> Where was that, no, it's at Coles. You know, it's in Coles and everything. Ladies and gents, that is right. We are back with the vlogs and the voiceovers. I reckon I had about 100 comments last week, and I reckon 95 of them were, where are the voiceovers? I'm back. It's about 35, 36 degrees. It's absolutely boiling. You can see I'm already sweating. Uh, we've got an absolutely sick team, as you know, playing with Mitch Robertson, which is absolutely awesome. So grateful for that opportunity. First clearance of actually onto the ball very, very quickly, but unfortunately uh, ended up being a bit of a contest. So I'm playing uh, kind of half forward, deep forward, kind of just like a free roaming forward, really, which was really, really good. Um, I really like playing that position, especially up here in Northern Territory. It's all about work race. 
First touch I get, the ball um, kind of spits out. My play goes in, I get the ball over the top, go for the right foot, no, no, and it just comes off the middle of my foot and I probably could have handballed it over, but unfortunately, yeah, no, no, it didn't count. Uh, and then I get a high tackle, give away a high tackle free kick, which wasn't very good. Um, so yeah, not a good start. So we are versing one of the best teams of the comp, and believe it or not, we actually start off with a fantastic amount of pressure, work rate, energy, positivity, Kick the first three goals after my boy Cass go back and bang this. That's the first three goals of the game. We are looking good. We do have a little bit of win, so we are pretty happy with that. Go to ground here, but do end up getting a nice little handball out to Ish. Another half forward. Gives it back to Jared Stokes, our captain. He used to play Sample as well, so he's an absolute gun. Uh, footballer, but this is just a great example here of our pressure and if you are um, Playing football against a team that is a bit better than you. These guys are probably one of the best teams This is how you have to bring this is the energy and pressure that you have to bring like, look at that Let's just chase down tackle chase down tackle. It's absolutely unbelievable We get the ball out here out wide just judge it a little bit better than my opposite number and take the mark Which was good go back and we just in a slow play like even though we've got the win Just a slow play go back and kick to Mitch Robinson Right, so Robbie's got the ball on the back flank here and we're just in a slow play, which is just, you don't need to go 100%, you know, 100 miles all the time. Then we get a 50 meter penalty and I'm on my bike as soon as that happens. I run up about uh, past, I think, eight people here and you can see I just put my head down and I'm going. There's a lot of people here that are being lazy on the opposition. So if you're a defender in the opposition, you've got to make sure that you do follow your player back here. I'm already in the forward pocket, straight forward, get a high tackle. Didn't really duck that much, I don't think. Uh, just tried to duck out of it, but ended up getting the free, free kick. The umpire goes, line up here just um, in front of your videographer. Always going to snap this through, um, and luckily it did go through the goals. I don't mean I was always going to kick a goal. I mean, I was always going to snap it. Um, luckily snapped it through, and the boys are very happy. That's our fourth goal for the game. Lay a little bit of a tackle here. There's not that much tackling in the NTFL. It's a little bit more uncontested, but still working really, really hard as much as I can to get those tackles. Robbo gets the ball here and gives it over to me. And boy, I do the rest. Left foot snap, about a second to go in the first quarter. That's our fifth goal of the quarter. and We are up, absolutely running rampant over this team. First time that me and Robbo linked up for a goal. Very, very exciting. And we're up to a fantastic lead at the start of the uh, second quarter here. We've obviously switched and get the ball here. And I'm feeling myself here. I'm ready. Get the hands. Go to kick it to someone. No. Step. And then I got confused. I, wasn't, I was like, oh, do I drop home? Do I snap it? I'm not happy with it. I went for the snap. I was like, oh, that was a sick drop step. I should have goaled that. Very disappointed. Good crowd in as well, which is awesome. Uh, and the boys were always looking for me as well, even though it's like a two-on-one here. It, if you keep jumping at the ball, then your opposition are going to start to get a little bit scared. Um, if you're jumping, they're going to hold you down, which is good. Gave a little kick here to Fitzy. Of course, he's going to go back and have a shot on goal. Don't be selfish all the time. There was a lot of wind here. Didn't want to kick it. Fitzy goes for goal here, but unfortunately, the ball doesn't quite go the full distance. But that's all right. We had plenty of numbers here at the fall of the ball. And we get a handball out, a few handballs out. Bolsey goes bang. We've already kicked one against the wind. So we're absolutely on fire at this point of the game. The boys are stoked. I'm stoked. Um, again, back into a slow play here. Like I said, you don't have to be going 100 miles an hour all the time, especially up here in Darwin. It's bloody hot as well. So it's good just to slow it down a little bit every now and again. Uh, a couple of handballs here, like just in the back line. Robbo gets it out of the center. Uh, kicks it to me, and I probably could have died for this. I'm going 100% here, but I just don't think I could have got it. I said, sorry, mate, I should have got there, but that's all right. Now here, someone goes back with the flight and gets uh, gets knocked out really, really badly. The game stopped, uh, and we have to call an ambulance. So the game is completely stopped. We're all standing on the sideline thinking, what are we going to do? Are we allowed to go out? The ambulance you can see there is leaving at the at the back. Um, this guy couldn't feel his feet at one stage, and so this was 30 minutes of time that's elapsed here. And they called. Well, initially what happened is they said the game's going to go ahead, and then 30 minutes got up, and they were like, "Sorry guys, we're not going to keep playing. We're going to end the game." So the game ends, um, and it's before half time, so there's no result. The match is abandoned. So like I said, unfortunately no result, um, but. 
obviously we're more concerned about the guy. Hopefully he's okay. I'm sure he went through for scans, and I think that he's he's uh, he's on the road to recovery. So fingers crossed for him. But it's a pretty serious situation um, with that sort of stuff. So you can't be disappointed. You can't be selfish. You have to be um, selfless in this type of thing that's happened. So, yep, uh, match is abandoned, and we're done. Play him a game of pool. Yeah, I'll beat you too. Yeah. Hang on, mate. Like, no, no. Name for like Mike Raven, he thinks he's better than me. Short vlog this weekend. Yeah. Short one. Off. Gang got caught off. How are we feeling about that? Yeah. Shout out to the guy we fucking hope is alright. Yeah. Jesus Christ. But yeah. fuck. They said that we we're gonna keep playing and then they fucking stopped it. Yeah. I don't know if we've got footage of it, but yeah. We we're 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 about. We played well, didn't we? Yeah. You played nicely. Big engine. Big engine. Big engine over here. at the back line from there. Yeah, I know. I'm running up and back, trying to get a lick. Yeah, let's try again. What was the go? What was happening in there, mate? What was happening? There was a lot of chitter chatter back and forth. We hope the guys are alright, I said that. We hope the fucking blokes are alright. Yeah, Captain hit, Joe Stokes, Kim. Um, yeah, fucking hell. Uh, what did they say at the end? Yeah, they said we were went playing. Over, yeah, it went over the 30 minute mark. Yeah, so, but they said we were playing. Yeah, but technically it went over five minutes. Oh. Couldn't do anything about it. You didn't argue hard enough. Hey, I, I, did, I did argue, but... I need a Johnny by my side. <laughs> I know. Johnny, we needed your big frame there to intimidate some people. Shit, eh? What's going on, guys? We've got a <laughs> It's a vlog off. It's a vlog off. All right, everyone, you have to view my vlog before you view Rob vlogs. Oh yeah, thank you. How'd you go? Too hot out there for you? Or is it all right? Are you are you glad it finished at half time? Because you're never gonna run it out. Oh, we all gotta wait for the is Uber driver. What happened today? Oh mate, you played well. Oh, so did you, mate. Nah, you're good. It was a great team effort, I reckon. We almost linked for the goal of the year, didn't we? Oh man, how many assists? Ah, uh, you, you were Three six cute. Yeah. If, if we could kick straight or what? Short <laughs> <laughs> vlog this week or what? This is yeah. Ethan Maney, very good man. I love his TikToks as well. Ethan yes. Maney fit. He's got a pretty good rig. Ah, cheers, um, nah, yeah, not what, as good as what, this one. Nah, <laughs> what's the go today? Couldn't kick straight. No, I could not <laughs> kick straight. <laughs> Turning to me last week or what? Oh no, nah, Shag got out in the fall, oh, but we won't talk about that. That's all right. That's all right. Yeah. I did see it actually down the yeah, yeah down, down, down that main end. Oh. Bloody hell! It's good. We're all having beers after the game though together, Boys getting around. Right. Yeah, getting around each other. Fly out tonight. Wait, you, you live in here, right? Yeah, I live in here, right? Yeah. Yeah. Well, not me, dog. I'm back to Melts. Oh, here we go. What's going on here? A bit of a collab. Oh, hey. collab. What's going on here? Hold on a sec. Hold on one sec. What's going on? What did you get, mate? What did you get? He's my known by TikTok, he's pretty famous, but we love him on the footy field, Tommy Bulch. What a bloke! It's, it's just TikTok. That's you. <laughs> That's you. Uh, this is dinner. We got a palmy. Palmy. Big pussy all over here. Here's dinner. Can you see me or not? <laughs> Oh. You can't upload that. No, nah. I can, I can. can. <laughs> yeah, oh, I got dinner. the vlog out, here we go. Yeah, that's what, what are you eating? Oh, mate, just the same as you. Rolls Royce or what? Got a few of the Rolls Royce, mate. Oh, yeah. yeah. That's not rare. Few of the, what are you eating, Mitch? I've finished. Oh, uh, you, you, you inhaled it. Done, mate. Yeah. <laughs> Yum. <laughs> Thank you very Excuse much. Me, that's it. Now we're yeah. in. Oh. Don't put it with me. You're the one who wanted it. You asked for it. You asked for it and you've given me nothing. How'd you go today? How many touches? Probably like four, man. How many goals? Uh, one. Okay, let's go to the next one. <laughs> how many goals? One. How many girls, how many touches? None, I just got smashed. You got smashed? And I was doing what? Take the GoPro off him. Where's Dalen? What's the time? 11, 11, 14. I think our flight leaves in about a minute. Pretty hungry, so we're gonna go for a little burger and some chippies. Burger bundles. Give it a minute. Oh, all right. It's about 
4 o'clock Darwin time, which means it's about 5.30 here in Melbourne time. Early morning, late flight. A little bit of sleep, not a lot. Um, but legends, that will be the end of the vlog. Obviously, a bit of a different game day vlog this week. Shout out to the bloke uh, that was injured. Fingers crossed that he's all good. Um, obviously, at the end of the day, we the only thing we care about is the safety of players in the game. So, um, I guess if that was one of my teammates or if that was me, I would hope that the game was was stopped and, and that I was looked after. Um, so, yeah, that was incredibly sad. But fingers crossed again, like I said, for the guy that he's all right. Uh, but ladies and gents, I probably look like absolute terribly right now because I reckon I've had about two hours sleep. Um, but I'll leave the vlog there. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it. No vlog next week, we're gonna buy, so uh, there'll be nothing going on. But um, yeah, like I said, like, subscribe, do all that sort of stuff because it means the absolute world to me when you do do that. Um, and that'll be the end of the vlog. Thank you, I love you. And as I always say, stay sexy. Yeah,